All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, Responsive Web Design, Learn HTML by Building a Cat Photo App, Step 3. All right. So the P element is used to create a paragraph of text on websites. We're going to create a P element below our H2 element and give it the following text right here. All right. So let's go over to the P element. Let's say P element HTML. All right. And the first thing that comes up is the W, pardon me, the MDM, but we're not going to go there. We're going to go down here to the W3 schools. All right. Uh, and let's read about this. So the definition and usage, the P tag defines a paragraph like we just learned. Uh, also, browsers all, pardon me, browsers automatically add a single blank line before and after each P element. So we can do something in CSS to get rid of that single blank line. And that's what this is saying. Use CSS to style paragraphs. Uh, other than that, it just says this uh, deep stuff that we don't need to talk about right now. Uh, but there's that. So let's come back over here. And so we are making a P element. We'll come down here and we'll say open P. Whoops. And then close P. All right. And then in between here, we're just going to type it out so that we can get some typing practice. See more cat photos in our gallery. All right. Uh, usually I like to, anyway, it doesn't matter what I like to do. Uh, so let's check it. Looks good. And submit it. All right. So now we're on to step four and we'll see you next time.